Athletes across the country welcome the 2023 Rossing Marathon in Swakopmund on Saturday. Organized by Rossing Uranium in conjunction with Swakop Striders, the event made history as it recorded the biggest participation since its inception 32 years ago. Runners once again competed in a 42 kilometers full marathon, 21 kilometers half marathon, 10 kilometers race, and a 5 kilometers fun walk. All proceeds collected from the entries of the 5 kilometers fun walk will go to the Cancer Association of Namibia. All eyes were on the half and full marathons, and with perfect weather conditions on the day, the pack was off to a promising start. This year's route passes through the town of Swakopmund before heading out onto the Hentis by road and back. After the start of the 21st and 42 kilometers races, it was time for the start of the 10 kilometers race, which is always the highlight for runners, professional and fun runners alike. In the men's 42 kilometers race, at the turning point, only two runners were leading, but Thomas Reinold proved too strong as he finished the race in a time of 2 hours, 14 minutes and 8 seconds, followed by Kefas Konjashili with a time of 2 hours, 16 minutes and 42 seconds. In the women's 42 kilometers race, the pack was spread out with runners unable to challenge Alina Armas. Armas won the race in a time of 2 hours, 44 minutes and 33 seconds, with Risa Dreyer in second in a time of 2 hours, 57 minutes and 37 seconds. Apart from being a competitive road race, the event was also used for fun by young and old who came out to enjoy the day. Um, yes, I get my, my, my competitors, the, the one who came second, the one who gave me tough time. That's why when I, we reach up to 25k is where I start to pick up for him to try if he follow me or not. For there, he didn't pick up. For him, he get tired. For me, I respond and I go until I finish the race. Uh, this is my eight times to win Rossing. Uh, with God, everything is possible. No pain, no game, no discipline, no result. I'm happy to win Rossing. Rossing Uranium Managing Director Johan Kutsia said that the event was a lot of fun, while for others, the challenge was like no other and he believed that the day was another step towards taking better care of oneself. Yeah, 2023 was a, was a great year for us. We had nearly, nearly a thousand entries. I don't think everybody pitched up, but it's really, really nice to be back and do it in reality. And as a slogan said, run more, worry less, um, I really think it worked. And it's great to see the people meeting up with each other again. And I really, really want to say congratulations to Ita and Armas, who won the 42-kilometer marathon, um, we are very, very proud of them. In total, more than 100,000 Namibia dollar was up for grabs in prize money, with the full marathon winners walking away with $10,000, as well as a development bonus of $20,000 each.